Welcome to our show this week, folks. I tell you what, you always tell me, Bob, we never know where you're going to end up next. Well, this week we're off the coast of Virginia. Virginia Beach, Virginia. That's right. No, I tell you what, striper. That's right, rockfish. Captain Rich Shot with Chesapeake Bay Sportfishing.com. He's going to be our host today, and we're going to put us on some of the big ones. You bet. Fish on, and we got to go. I tell you what, this and a whole lot more on Bob Redford's Outdoor Magazine. I got to get out of the catbird seat. Bob Redford's Outdoor Magazine begins right now. All right, let's go. Folks, Redford and Nate took a deer like this before. That's why you come. To Mexico right there, folks. Game, Bob. Good shot, Bob. Ooh. That is a first for Bob Redford, huh? There we go. Today's show is brought to you in part by Pure Fishing, makers of Shakespeare, Berkeley, Abu, Garcia, and Penn. Pure Fishing, addressing the needs of anglers worldwide. You know, truck guys, I like to get the job done right. Measure twice, cut once, I always say. Let me give you a hand there. Thanks. Did you know the Silverado XFE has an EPA estimated 22 highway? How about your F-150? Less. And this Silverado has 315 horsepower. Yours? Less. Silverado's powertrain is back for five years or 100,000 miles. Yours? 40,000 miles less. Don't blame the carpenter. Blame the tool. Chevy Silverado, America's best truck. Bennington Seed's newest food plot seed mixture was developed to attract deer and last for years without having to replant. Rackmaster Elite features some of the best forage in clover like Dorana and Patriot White Clovers. These clovers produce over 30% more protein and are scientifically proven to last three times longer than traditional clover blends. For longer lasting food plots that will encourage bigger deer, be sure to include Rackmaster Elite. To find more information on Rackmaster or other Pennington Seed products, visit the website or contact a dealer near you. The Trilene 100% professional grade fluorocarbon from Berkeley is remarkably clear. It has little to no memory and is extremely abrasion resistant. But most importantly, it's the most impact resistant fluorocarbon you can buy, which means you'll hear a lot more Woo! Woo! Woo and a lot less. Oh, 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 oh. Trilene fluorocarbon from Berkeley. <laughs> Woo! For anglers who want to catch more fish. A top performing dog is the result of all the right factors coming together. Genetics, training, exercise, a diligent and dedicated handler, and nutrition a dog can thrive on. Purina Pro Plan is formulated with the need of hardworking dogs in mind. Purina Pro Plan's nutrition comes from a combination of high quality ingredients that includes real meat and wholesome grains. Fuel the champion within your dog with the nutrition they deserve. Pro Plan Performance Formula. Today's show is brought to you in part by Pepsi and all their fine products. Pepsi, the official soft drink of Bob Redfern's Outdoor Magazine. On this week's Chevy destination, Bob and his crew head north to Virginia Beach, Virginia. Virginia Beach is located on the Atlantic Ocean at the mouth of the Chesapeake Bay and is listed in the Guinness Book of Records as having the longest pleasure beach in the world. Known as a resort getaway during the summer, Virginia Beach's winter months are spent fishing, producing the best striped bass fishing in the world. Anglers come from all over the country to get in on the awesome Virginia Beach striper action. If you're traveling to Virginia Beach for fishing or a family vacation, be sure you're getting there in a new Chevy truck. Chevy, still America's best built truck. <laughs> I can't even get it out of the rod holder. Folks, welcome back to our show. We are rock fishing off Virginia Beach. And I tell you what, my host for the trip, Captain Rich Shot. Hey, Rich. Hey, man. Fish on here, bud. Nice fish. Woo! Looky here, would you? Looky here. Okay. Now, I know it seems a little bit cold today, and it's not bad. But Rich and all of his guys here fish pretty much 12 months out of the year. And we'll talk to him a little bit about this in a minute as soon as I get this big Hummer up to the boat. Do you know you got your union card for that net? <laughs> ah, turn around so all the folks can see. This is this is the guy right here, man. Get Rich shot. This big fish. All right, let me get over there. Right, right up the hole there. Yeah. All right, I got you, Bo. One more oh, yeah. <laughs> Come aboard. Now, we got everybody here today is helping us. Steve is behind the controls. 
Rich is on the net. And I tell you what, fish all, get him, get him. Get him, Rich. It's yours, go, get him. Read him in. I'm gonna hold this one up for the camera. Oh yeah. That's a nice fish. Yes, yes siree. Hey, I tell you what, striper fishermen eat your heart out right here. Look at this, all right, get him, Rich. This is the uh, 10. Okay. Now we're catching these fish in about what, 30, 50 feet of water? It's about 50, 55, okay. 60 feet of water. We gonna put this one in the box. You want to let him go? Let's go let him go. All right, folks, we're going to do our part for conservation right here. Woohoo! All right, man. All right, Bo. Work him out, man. I know you went to the gym this morning, didn't yeah. you? Huh? <laughs> Woo! Now, fish on. Got it. Got it. All right, man. Okay. <laughs> Woo! Hey, come on, Rich. You got to help me out here, Bo. Hey man, I tell you what, I kind of like these with the short ones, huh? Does that one give you a little trouble, Bo? Folks, I tell you what, this is a blast this here. This is a nice fish here. Yes, sir. -y. Chesapeake Bay Sport Fishing at its finest. And I tell you what, hey Rich, now you guys pretty much fish year round, but here in Virginia Beach, you're fishing down here, what, December through March? December through March, and okay. actually we're you know, fishing the Atlantic Ocean. Yeah, man. A lot of people don't realize how good the fishing can be. You're you exactly right. You know, when it's right. so cold out, but these now, strippers I need to love come it. underneath this? All right. Okay, all right. Got it. Folks, this is some awesome fishing here. Beautiful boat, 52-footer. Twin 680 Cummins. Net profits, huh? All right, Rich, how you coming, Bo? Hey, that's pretty. That's a pretty nice fish down there. Oh gosh, and we'll have to tell all the folks here in a minute how we're how we're hooked up. Got another one there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let me get out of the way here so you guys can see that fish. What will that one weigh, guys? All right. 15, 20 pounds, yeah. Bob, you ready for your chef up? Uh, I'm coming. That's all right. Let, let Rich get his glory day there, Bo. You got to hold your fish out for the camera, Rich. Come on, man. Go ahead, Captain Steve. You got it. We'll keep him letting go. All right. I love this. Golly. Oh, you got a nice one. Got a nice I one. love this. You got Tommy, you got you got, you got Big Bob. You got a good one on there? Yeah, yeah man. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, folks, I tell you what, I can't tell you how much fun this is. Huh? Hey, Rich, this has got to be a fishing trip of a lifetime. Huh? A lot of people don't realize they catch that big trophy. Look at this. I'm trophy telling fish. you. This is absolutely awesome. Wow. Hey, you one of Yeah. Oh, look at that fish. And you were going to say before you got interrupted? I was going to say, you know what? Um, one of the nice things about Virginia yeah. is they actually, for people when you get the citation fish, yeah. I don't know the exact amount, but like, you know, get a fish over 40 inches, 40 pounds. Oh, Virginia yeah. gives you a very nice uh, wooden plaque as well. Yeah. Hang on. It's hard to catch second time, you know. Yeah, man, no kidding. <laughs> oh, look at that. Woo! Look at that, folks, right there. Uh, hey, Rich, turn around here, Bo. Smile for everybody out there, Bo. I tell That's you what. Nice looking fish there. This is a beautiful looking fish, huh? Hey, I gotta tell you. All right, we going in the box with we'll, this one? Yeah, we'll play it, man. We're, we're gonna get some bigger ones than that. All right, okay. That's gonna be a small one here. In All right, bed. bro. All we're waiting on those magic words. Fish on, huh? Fish on right there. Holly. Hey, you ain't in Grandpa's striper net right here, man. This is it. Oh! That's almost like twin engines right there. Folks, I tell you what. Captain Rich Shot and his crew, they would love to take you out here. Again, you gotta log on to his website. Why am I excited? Hey, when you can catch fish like that in less than 15 minutes, let me tell you something. ChesapeakeBaySportFishing.com. Log on to his website, and we're gonna hear more from you just a little bit. All right, guys. Woo. Folks, stay tuned. When we come back, more striper rock fishing from Virginia Beach, Virginia, right here with Captain Rich Shot. Today's show is brought to you by Club Car, the official utility vehicle of Bob Redfern's Outdoor Magazine, and by Purina Pro Plan, fueling the champion within your dog with the nutrition they deserve. 
most gun makers just add a new feature to improve performance. Every component of the Browning X-Bolt works together to deliver the most crucial feature, total accuracy. The Browning X-Bolt, an all-new rifle system designed for total accuracy. With IntelliTrack technology, there's no stopping to shift gears, no stopping to lock and unlock differentials, and no stopping your adventure. Introducing the world's first fully automatic four-wheel drive utility vehicle, the XRT1500 from Club Car. Drive it once and you'll know. See your local Club Car dealer. Good morning, honey. Not today. You are not going fishing today! Ugly Stick, America's strongest, most sensitive rod. Today's show is brought to you in part by Chevrolet and Chevy Trucks, the official ride of Bob Redfern's Outdoor Magazine. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on, oh yeah. You know, Rich, there's nothing like the hum of a reel, though. Huh? That's, a nice, that's a nice fish when you see him pulling out oh, the rag like yeah. that. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Now listen while I'm reeling this thing in. Get over here, man. Don't run away from me. I'm just getting me. this line out of the way. Okay, I may need some coaching up here. Catching the biggest. You know, one of the big things, you know, when you're fishing here for these rockfish, yeah. you gotta make sure that line stays tight, the rod always stays bent. Gotcha. Because um, you give them any little slack, because you, you'll see when you come in, they, their, their mouths are like paper thin. Well, and they get a little hole in their mouth, and that, they get any bit of turn, they can make a turn and spit that hook very quickly. Well, let me ask you a question here. Now, I mean, you know, we've caught a couple 25, 30 pound fish here. Right. That's, those are babies. Oh yeah, that, that. we don't get, unless it's over 40 pounds, we don't get excited. Oh yeah. So see, uh, we'll, listen, we'll, we'll uh, see some of those. Yeah, he doesn't get excited over 40. Okay, okay. <laughs> hey, I'll tell you what, you know, it's one of the great things. It's the first time for me to come up here to fish off Virginia Beach. You know, and one of the things too, is I'm so found, glad that I found you, because I'll be honest with you, who would ever thought Virginia Beach and the fishery here that, that awaits exactly. you. Exactly. And people know? You know, sometimes don't like the cold weather, but you know, some of the best striper fishing in the world, if not the best, is this time, you know, January, February. Right. Hey, oh, yeah. Tommy, can you, you got the net? You got the net? Okay, okay, go ahead. Okay. And you know, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. One more time. Oh, that yeah. was a little nicer fish. I'm just going to back up a little bit. There you go. Oh yeah. Wow. Right. Wow. Goodness. Put that back in the holder. See, so, so yes, they're, they're getting a little bigger consistently. And they are, yeah. okay. And then we're gonna show you this rig that these things are are fishing for today is oh yeah, look at that. Wow. That's a, that's a ruby lift parachute. Right. Right there. Probably about twelve ounces. Got I mean, a nine inch shed, double rig hook. And you guys have these things made up special. Yep. Wow. Yep. That's Three awesome. Well, I got I to gotta show all the folks there out there this fish, because I'll be honest with you, these are awesome. They are awesome. Look at that thing. Oh, man. Wow, Rich. That's a nice oh. fish. Ah. <laughs> Woo! Listen to that. Fish on! Get him, Rich. Get him, Bo. This has got to be yours, Bo. I'm going to coach. <laughs> all right. Another nice fish here. Hey, look at that, would you? Wow. You know, and I, I like your style. Uh, you, you've got great form. You know, when you're pulling that back, no, no. You know, you know what I'm saying, folks, huh? 
Woo! Well, you know, like I said earlier, it's one of the biggest mistakes people make when they're trying to pull these big fish in is they give them any, any little bit of slack and they're gone. Well, you're right. You keep that pressure on and just, you know, slow, steady pull. And, you know, the, the good thing about it is, is with you guys, when I traveled around the country and fish with, with great folks like you, all your crew, I, I take all these tips away because, again, I, I'm not an expert fisherman. I just, I just do what you guys tell me to do because, again, every fishing trip is different. Right. And, and, different you know, styles that, of fishing and everything. Exactly. And that's the great thing about coming with a guide service like Chesapeake Bay Sport Fishing. I mean, you guys can coach even the novice fishermen up. Absolutely. And, and that's what's really great about it. Now, I want to I want to ask you, how did you get started in all this? Well, you know, it, it, quite interesting. You know, I, I love to fish. I've fished since I was four. And it was kind of a great way for me to just kind of support my habit. Come on, wow. have fun. Um, enjoy um, you know, entertaining people. And we... Entertaining people's first and foremost, having fun, wow. and uh, fishing is just you know part of the action. Now you started in 2003. Yes, 2003. Okay. Yeah. Great. Wow. And, and you know, look, you've learned fast. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Oh. That's for making a lot of mistakes. Yeah, yeah. There you go. <laughs> I, I got that. Tommy, you gonna get him? Going to net him. Huh? You want me to net him? All right, man. Take it, hey Bob. Yo. If you can grab that end of that net. Yeah. And then let the net go when you get it up. That way they get tangled up in the uh, I got you. Okay. In the bucktail. Yeah, man. I'm going to bring it right in there. Go drop the net. Got it. All right. Did I do that right? Yes, sir. You got it right. All right, man. Okay. Get it squirreled up? Nah, just a little bit. Ah, there we go. Let me get the net out the way. You did that like a pro, man. Huh? Right there. Right Woo! on. Yes, sir. You know, these, these little pen rods are a lot less, not as stout, and they yeah. have a lot more action with that fish. Yeah, they I make those you. smaller fish seem like a lot more yeah, uh, play man. to them. I'll tell you. He swallowed that one, didn't he, Tommy? Yeah, thank you. All right. Now, the total fish for a trip, you could hold up to what? How many guys on, on the boat? Coast Guard says 47 people, but wow. you know, 12 to 15, maybe 20 is is comfortable. Fish on, fish on! Oh, okay, got it, got it, got it. Woo, fish on over there! All right, grab it, get him. Come back. Fish on, <laughs> yeah, throw him back. Woo -hoo. Go oh. ahead, take it. I think I got one line. We're gonna have to get out of the way, guys. What you got? Yep. Yeah. Let's see what you got here. Okay, man. I tell you what, you got one too? Yeah, here you go. Take it. I love it, bro. I love it. Got it? Yep. All right, man. That's what I'm talking about. Woohoo! Oh, folks, I tell you what, this is some awesome fishing. I can't tell you. Awesome fishing. I mean, the action goes all day long like this, Rich. Non-stop. Huh? Wow! Oh, yeah. Yeah, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Look at that fish. Oh, man. Look at that. Woo! Look at that. Look out. Those things are huge. Golly. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. Oh my goodness, look at that. I tell you what, Rich, the crew is just like a well old machine, man. Wow. Woo! Oh my heavens. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Oh my heavens. You got a good one there, buddy. Oh, look at that. Oh my. All right. <laughs> you, know, you know it's serious when the captain, get, when the captain gets excited. Oh, man. Come on up here. Yes, sir, sister. Come on up here, sister. Come on, sister. Oh! Did we lose him? He's barely hooked. Ah. Barely hooked. Well, folks, you got to see him. We didn't get him on board. That one probably had to go at least 45, yeah, at least 50 45. pounds. That was a nice fish. Oh, Very nice my fish. goodness. But that's all part of fishing, yeah, you know? Yeah, it is. Look at that, man. I was working my heart out on that one. Golly. Wow. That is awesome. Oh. 
Fish on, fish on. Oh, oh my goodness. You guys are killing me, man. You're working me out. All right. Oh, that was way out there. Lots of line on that one. Hey, how did I end up doing this, bud? Where you been? Hey, it's all good. Ah. Oh, man. Hey, folks, I tell you what, no kidding. I mean, these fish are coming one right after the other. Huh? Have you ever been on a fishing trip like this? I doubt it. At least I haven't. Not catching these kind of fish. All right, coach. You getting it back in the water? You're doing a great job here getting yeah. these lines back in the water. I love you know, your vote of confidence, you know, man. <laughs> we're firm believers that more lines in the water, yeah. bigger baits equal more fish, bigger fish. Well, and that, so we do our best on you're that. You're exactly right. Man, it is absolutely awesome. Now, I'll tell you, I've been working on this fish for 10 minutes. Or it seems like. Oh, wow. Just one right after the other, folks. I tell you what, again, I'm not kidding you. You know, I don't, I don't kid you about fishing. Matter of fact, I don't kid you about nothing. But this is a trip you've got to do. And oh, by the way, if you miss the Virginia Beach piece of this, after March when they go back north, you can do this same thing in the Chesapeake Bay. And again, Rich and his guys will take you. They've got two great boats. Oh yeah, man. All right, it's all about you. I've done my thing now. I've done my thing. Yeah, he sucked that one all the way down, didn't he? Woo! Yeah, man. Wow. Yeah. Don't look him in the eyes. Yeah, man. Oh yeah, good to go, bro. Good to go. Here, put him in the put him in the hatch. Wow. Yeah. And folks, I will tell you again, what Rich has told us here, nothing, nothing beyond getting 28 to 30 fish in less than an hour, maybe an hour and a half. This is just, this is awesome, oh, bro. This is awesome. Got to do it, huh? That's great. Woo! God, man, you're a great coach. All right, we got to get it back in the water. Today's show is brought to you in part by Pennington Seed, makers of all your wildlife forage products. Power bait from Berkeley looks, moves, and smells more like the real thing. And since it tastes more like the real thing, fish bite and hold on longer, up to 18 times longer than other artificials, giving you Woo! more time to set the hook, which means you'll be hearing a lot more often. Power bait from Berkeley. What you need to catch more fish. One tribe, y'all. One tribe, y'all. We one tribe, y'all. We all one people. Let's catch amnesia. Let's catch amnesia. Forget about all that evil. What do you care about? Introducing the Pepsi Refresh Project. We're giving away millions for ideas that move the world forward. Every Pepsi refreshes the world. You know, truck guys, I like to get the job done right. Measure twice, cut once, I always say. Let me give you a hand there. Thanks. Did you know the Silverado XFE has an EPA estimated 22 highway? How about your F-150? Less. And this Silverado has 315 horsepower. Yours? Less. Silverado's powertrain is backed for five years or 100,000 miles. Yours? 40,000 miles less. Don't blame the carpenter. Blame the tool. Chevy Silverado, America's best truck. Introducing the 2008 line of America's most accurate muzzle loaders by CBA. The Acura, a new standard in brake action muzzle loading. The Optima Elite interchangeable barrel system. Electra, world's first electronic ignition muzzle loader. So how are we able to do it? All of these CBA rifles come with a premium Bergara barrel. That's how. Learn more at CBA.com or BergaraBarrels.com. Today's show is brought to you by Browning and Winchester Repeating Arms, the official firearms of Bob Redfern's Outdoor Magazine. Well, folks, we're here in Rudy's Restaurant here in the inlet, just outside of 
Well, I tell you what, it's a beautiful Virginia beach. And I tell you what, the fish that this guy cut up for us, Captain Steve Dunn, listen, this guy put us on some great fish today. And hey, Rich, I tell you what, now it's time for what we've been waiting for today. Listen, we're going to be eating here. We've got great service. Hey, we got Chef Kevin here who's going to put it on the plate. Look at that. Wow. Wow, that looks awesome. Oh, my goodness. We got some bronzed. <laughs> Uh, wow. Some pesto encrusted, some Rockefeller, Ooh. pepper seared with blue cheese, and I gave you all some of our uh, Chesapeake topping, which is lump crab meat, Smithfield ham, and she'll bring out some Vernet sauce for y'all. And oh. um, then we also have the buffalo fried. And just straight there you are, though. You did it. Yep. Huh? Yes, I'm telling you, man. Right leave it there, right yep. there. Wow, I tell you what, right here at Rudy's, listen, guys, I tell you what, where else can you come right from the boat? It's fresh cut, it's cooked immediately. What hey, a great deal. Exactly. Great presentation. Great Doesn't job. Doesn't get any better than that. Well, listen, I tell you what. Now, i got to talk to the both of you guys here now. Okay, we're down here. It's it's December to March. We're doing the winter fishing for rockfish. Now it's getting ready to go, and you guys are going to be moving here soon to go back up to the bay. Tell us, everybody, about that. Well, you know, what happens is the fish move up north, usually starting like mid-April. We'll actually start fishing up in the Chesapeake Bay for the same type of striped bass. They're going to average probably 32 to 36 inches at that point, and we'll fish through them all summer um, until the fall. Well, you got two boats. I mean, I know Steve, you're gonna you're gonna still have net profits here. Yeah, yep, I'll okay. be on net profits. And then you're gonna have another boat when you get up there. Yeah. Right. Yeah, we got Jesse Girl. They're both 52 feet Chesapeake's. Wow. And uh, room for a lot of people. We can accommodate 47 people on each boat, and we do a lot of big corporate stuff. And uh, well, I tell you what, guys. I, hey, Steve, it was a deal, though. I'm telling it's you. Exciting. It was now, great. if anybody wants, and I'm gonna shake your hand, okay? Because I tell you what, <laughs> trying to control these guys. Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> they do a great job. But if folks want to come fishing with you they want to log onto your website they want to see your videos out there because I'm telling you this guy's got some great stuff out there how can they do it? they can just simply go out on the web go to Chesapeake Bay sportfishing.com and you know very easily be found um, well exactly. I tell you what and, and and also I will tell you folks you can also go to our website at bobredford.com log on to Bob's top 16 and these guys are going to be at the top of the list because trust me you just don't catch rockfish and stripe and have the connections here to eat it too. Yep, absolutely. Perfect, there you perfect go. presentation. There we go. Well, folks, I'll tell you what, it's a great show. I'm going to get ready to eat some of this fish before it gets cold. That's all we got time for this week. I got to thank both of you guys, okay, now with a handshake one more time. Thank you. And it has been a pleasure being with these guys. The outdoors are our passion. I want it to be yours too. Come on up, come fishing with these guys. I guarantee you won't regret it. And we'll see you next week. Hotel accommodations for Bob Redfern and the crew provided by the Best Western Oceanfront in Virginia Beach, Virginia. Bob Redfern's Outdoor Magazine brought to you in part by the following sponsors. By Chevrolet, still building America's best truck. By Pure Fishing, makers of Shakespeare, Berkeley, Abu, Garcia and Penn, CVA muzzle loaders, Club Car, Browning, and Winchester Repeating Arms. Pepsi Bottling Group. Purina Pro Plan, Winchester Ammunition, an American legend, and by Core Pro, the official headwear of Bob Redfern. For recipes, outdoor articles, or to post a comment on today's show, visit online at www.bobredfern.com.